Hi everyone. So today we're going to be doing a comparison between the Dyson Ball Animal 3, the Shark ZU632 0M powered liftaway, and the Kenmore Allergen Seal Pet Anti-Tangle. We have a large amount of pet here, 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 and here. And we're going to be comparing the anti-tangle performance. I'm not really too concerned about the cleaning performance. They all pick up hair just fine. What I'm really concerned about is how well they keep hair from getting tangled in their brush rolls. And that is the whole point of this video. So let's start cleaning. We're going to start off with the Kenmore. We're going to make several passes over the hair. Regular speed vacuuming passes about like this. All the bins have some dirt in them for realism since nobody's vacuum is perfectly clean once they started using it. All right. That's about right, right there. Now we're gonna do the shark. Whoops. We got the shark. Now let's do the Dyson. I'm gonna move the camera just slightly towards the Dyson because it's a little bit out of frame. And I forgot to plug the Dyson in. So let's do that. It's usually pretty helpful for if you want it to work to make sure it's plugged in. All right. That noise you hear in the background, that sounds like wind is a game that's paused. Dyson, see if it can tackle this pile. All right, so now I'm gonna lower the tripod and we're gonna flip these vacuums over. We're gonna see how good of a job they did. So now let's see who did the best job. So we're gonna start with the Kenmore. So you can see that there is some hair on the brushes. There's a bit of hair, you can see it stuck right here. The individual bristles has hair stuck on them so it is not 100% tangle free. This was an unrealistic test, but over time as you clean up hair, it might build up. So it's not 100% tangle free, but did a pretty darn good job. The majority of the hair is inside of the bin. Let's check the shark next. So here's the shark. Unfortunately for the shark, it didn't do a particularly good job. There's quite a lot of hair still stuck on the brush roll, as you can see. Move the Dyson over just a little bit. But as you can see, the shark still has a lot of hair stuck on its brush roll. See as I rotate it. This is only first gen 0M. I'm sure that the newer ones like on the Stratos could do better, but as you can see, the shark didn't do a particularly good job of picking up that hair. Now we're gonna move on to the Dyson. As you can see, the Dyson didn't give a crap about that hair. This brush roll is completely clean. Look at this. There's like a tiny bit if I go like that, but you can't even see it on camera. If I zoom in, there you go. You can see the little bits of hair right there, but pretty much insignificant amount of pet hair on the brush roll. By far, the Dyson did the best job. It was able to clean up all this hair without much issue at all. So I hope you enjoyed this video of the Dyson Ball Animal 3, Shark ZU 632, and Kenmore Allergen Seal Pad Anti-Tangle. I'll see you all next time.